Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face while you're sleeping. Every once in a while, a new theory is brought up that baffles us entirely. While none of the theories we present to you have ever been authenticated, that doesn't mean there's no truth to them. That being said, let us get into 10 theories about the universe that will blow your mind. Number 10. Multiverse Theory You might have already heard about the concept of the parallel universe, where everything is the same but also different. In this parallel universe on Earth, any scenario is possible. For example, dinosaurs could still exist there, or something similar. But what if more than one universe did exist? What if there were billions? What if there were a never-ending number of various realities? This is exactly what the multiverse theory is about. The theory suggests that we are living in bubbles, which pop into existence, a bit like soap bubbles. If you take the Big Bang Theory into consideration, then this would mean that the birth of our universe was just the existence of one bubble in a huge sea of expanding universes. Number 9. We live in a black hole. It would be outrageous if you didn't already know that space is a vacuum, and that black holes suck in everything. But could this mean we actually live in a black hole? Some physicists believe it's possible. For most people, their knowledge of black holes mostly comes from sci-fi, which doesn't explain it fully. It is said that all of the matter that gets sucked into a black hole might end up turning into a new universe on the other end. But what's going on inside that black hole? This theory shows calculations that the theoretical other end of a black hole is a time-reversed version of the black hole, implying that compression and expansion of matter is mathematically equivalent to the creation of a universe. So, in a way, the universe that we know is waiting to either be born or is waiting to die. Number 8. String Theory the string theory was part of a research project begun by physicist Werner Heisenberg and later picked back up by others. It is basically the unified description of gravity and particle physics. String theory is the idea that the fundamental building blocks of nature are string-like rather than point-like, hence atoms. String theory is considered a self-contained mathematical model that describes all fundamental forces and forms of matter. So basically, it's the answer to everything as we know it. But string theory has one very unique consequence that no other theory of physics has had before. Extra dimensions. This theory predicts the number of dimensions of space-time. For the mathematics of string theory to be consistent, the number of dimensions of space-time must be 10. And according to physics, we live in the third dimension. So theoretically, there's seven more dimensions we don't know about yet. Number 7. White Holes Now, we just got done talking about black holes, which is basically what happens when a star dies and then makes energy, essentially a hole, that sucks in all matter and light cannot escape. But have you heard about white holes? White holes, to put it plainly, are the opposite of the black hole theory. They chuck out whatever the black hole sucks in. A white hole is a hypothetical region of space-time which cannot be entered from the outside, although matter and light can escape from it. In this sense, it is the reverse of a black hole, which can only be entered from the outside. White holes are a completely theoretical concept, but if they're the opposite of black holes, are white holes the birth of a star? Probably this is just another interesting idea put forth by physicists, but white holes could help explain the birth of the universe. Number 6. Simulation Theory The simulation theory is exactly what it sounds like, a theory that puts forward the idea that we might be living in a computer simulation. <laughs> yeah, we know, we think it sounds crazy too. It explains that, because of the chances of technological singularities taking place in the universe, it is quite likely that advanced civilizations, either us in the future or aliens in a galaxy several light years away, have created or will create simulations. Since the number of these simulations could be infinite, it's actually quite likely we're actually living in a computer simulation. To further support this mind-blowing theory, one theoretical physicist observed something astonishing in his recent string theory research. 
deep inside the mathematics we use to describe our universe, a computer code has been found. Yeah, you heard that right, computer code. So, is computer code not unique to humanity? As we progress as an intelligent species, was it expected that we would eventually find this? Are we actually living in one giant computer? Number five, the Fermi paradox. The Fermi paradox is a theory that puts forward an argument made by a couple of physicists who presented an alleged contradiction between how many alien civilizations are thought to be in the universe and our lack of evidence for their existence. This paradox can be supported by the Drake equation. The Drake equation was formulated by Frank Drake. He argued that since there are billions of galaxies in the universe, there could actually be intelligent life out there. But how much? When using the Drake equation, we can't look for a definite answer, but rather look at the questions that are brought up when attempting to come up with an answer. Clearly, there is a huge amount of guesswork involved when filling in the blanks, such as what we perceive as extraterrestrial or what life means to us. According to our understanding of science, we think life should resemble us, but what if it doesn't? As someone once said, two possibilities exist. Either we're alone in the universe, or we're not. Both are equally terrifying. Number four, the false vacuum universe theory. The false vacuum universe theory suggests that our own universe is actually in a false phase of state as part of a much bigger universe, which means that our own universe and everything we know is fleeting and unstable. What this actually means is that theorists are of the belief that this universe that we're in will eventually pop into the much larger universe, or the normal state, meaning everything we know in our visible universe will cease to exist almost immediately without warning. Sounds great, right? Not at all terrifying. Number three, the terror management theory. We experience life all around, either dying or being reborn. But we as humans, consciously or subconsciously, deny, deep down deny what we know to be our fate. We don't understand it, nor do we really want to know more than we do. The fear of death, or the terror management theory, explains that everything we've ever achieved or have done has been purely motivated by the desire to live, while realizing that death cannot be cheated. Even so, humans as intelligent species are not able to grasp the concept of death. Hence, they spend their entire life creating and believing in cultural elements that show how to make themselves stand out as individuals and give their life significance and meaning. It is said and is a fact that death creates anxiety in humans. It marks unexpected and random moments that, essentially, makes the unknowable the ultimate fear. This causes people to spend most of their life and energy to explain, stall, and avoid death. But our fears must be faced at one point or the other. And with that, it's now time for today's subscriber pick. Today's photo was sent to us by one of our subscribers, so if you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it on over to us. Who knows? We might even feature it in a future video. Number two. You might have noticed that we humans, if we tend to believe in aliens, refer or think of them as one singular species. A very popular example are green Martians. But a new theory has been brewing that essentially says, if we humans are so diverse and come in a range of colors, tones, races, etc., who is to say that aliens don't? There's a highly likely chance that aliens are just as diverse, if not more so. For example, Aliens that belong to one planet could be of an entirely different color in the south, say green, and in the north could be stark white. Who are we to say what is and isn't possible? Number one, the universe is a hologram. This theory suggests that the universe we see is nothing more than a hologram created by the universe itself. The crux is that when we look at the night sky, the faraway stars and galaxies we see are really just like a picture projected onto a wall. This holographic theory could provide the explanation as to why the universe appears weak and fragile, almost when broken down to the most basic of energy scales. 
do remember that a holographic image is made when you cover an object with the light from a laser, and then a second laser jumps off the reflective surface of the first laser. Another light source then brightens the image to produce the hologram. It's thought that if variations in gravitational waves are caused by different patterns of light, then it would kickstart this holographic image generation process. And if this theory is ever proven correct, it would mean we would need to change a lot of our perceptions of what we think we know about the universe. Well, that concludes our list of the 10 theories about the universe that will blow your mind. Let us know in the comment section below which one of these shocked you the most. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that bell icon.